What's up everybody? Thanks for visiting the channel. Sorry I've been slow on updates lately. It's late in the year, which means we're close to Christmas time. And usually I like to try to take some time off to handle things around the house and work on some projects. Been really slow on the car. Uh, haven't really been outside much because it's cold and I can't seem to make my body move. Also working on the basement and finishing up a lot of last minute things for work towards the end of the year. End of the year can be slow or it can be really busy, and right now it's busy. Which probably means 2018 is going to be busy too. Anyway, uh, today I'm working on something fun. This this is the next CNC project. This will be my son's Christmas present. He loves Yoda and he loves to say this, and so I'm looking forward to making this for him. Tap magic down. Tap magic helps lube the uh, cutter. I don't really have a better way of doing this yet. Someday I'll build a automated feed system for it, but for now this works. So what I traditionally do when I load these projects, I zero it, I get it set where I need it to be, I hit run and it comes out for me to load the cutter and then that's when I turn it on. My daughter is an extremely strong-willed child and she is awesome and she loves Black Widow and the Avengers so this is hers this is Black Widow and it's a message to her that I'm sure she already knows and this is my first time using this this type of bit it's a quarter inch shank but it goes down to a 1 16th inch tip and this is meant specifically for CNC routers it's a set from Whiteside, and I got it at Woodcraft. 